Taurus, welcome to your weekly reading. This reading is for the week of May 30th, 2022. So let's jump right into it, Aries. On Monday, I see that there are a lot of emotional balance or you're just being... Um, aware of your emotional balance or of your feelings for someone. You're finding out that you have a lot of feelings and strong feelings for someone or vice versa. Of course, maybe someone is informing you that they have very strong and balanced feelings towards you. On Tuesday, there is some kind of separation or maybe you're looking back at some situation where you felt some kind of loss or separation, of course. On Wednesday, you were working together uh, to, in some kind of collaboration to improve the state of things or to improve your art, your craft, or also the environment where you live or the environment where you work. On Thursday, um, you are being a little bit introspective, but also you're feeling the need to study, to read, uh, to improve your knowledge, or simply you are uh, training someone that is younger than you in what regards to your work. On Friday, you are feeling a little bit protective. Uh, maybe you're, you're feeling that someone is trying to attack you or to take your place. So you're building some kind of barrier between you and other people or some specific person in order to protect yourself. Um... On Saturday, you have emotional and financial abundance, the card of the happily ever after. On Sunday, some kind of conflict makes you feel like you need to defend yourself. But, you know, you are uh, defending yourself from a privileged point. So everything is going to be all right. The overall energy of the reading, which is what's on your mind, is the star. Telling me that you're very dreamy this week, you're healing maybe, or you're dreaming about your future goals or your future love life. This week I'm also using the Magical Mermaids and Dolphins Oracle cards for an additional message for your week area. So let's see what the Oracle has to say. Make a wish. This is a magical moment. Make a wish and enjoy manifestation. It's manifestation, I'm sorry. Now let's read the complete message. Say an affirmative prayer right now, which means stating your desire as if it were already true. So funny, right? Make a wish. <laughs> With the star card right, right beside it. Thank heaven for this reality and feel it in your heart and belly that your dream is actually a reality. For example, say, thank you heaven for whatever desire it is. I'm truly grateful for your continuous support. Now is a magical moment. Go into a quiet space, even if it's just for a moment. Close your eyes and imagine that your wish has come true. Feel it with your entire being. Then express thanks for this gift and release like a helium balloon that goes straight to heaven. If you need to take action to co-create this wish, you'll be, giving, you'll be giving strong and repetitive guidance in the form of feelings, thoughts, ideas, inner words, signs, visions or dreams. It's important that you follow this guidance in order to bring the wish into physical form. Well... This is what I have for you this week, Aries. Thank you very much for sharing your time with me. I wish you a wonderful, wonderful week. Take care out there and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.